Hey everyone, it's Rara, and welcome back to the next episode of Luigi's Mansion. Um, yeah, I... <laughs> if you're watching these two episodes back-to-back, -back, episode 9 and this ep episode 10, uh, it must be quite the experience for you. Uh, but for me, you know, I, I needed a mental freaking reset because I... Well, if you, if you saw the last episode... You know, you know. Anyways, in this episode, we're gonna uh, do some stuff. But yeah, I ranted a lot. That was, that was what happened. I just, I ranted a lot. Okay, so in this episode, we just saved, right? So we're good. We're basically going to finish Luigi's Mansion, I think. Like there really isn't much left to do. Uh, and if I, if I look over at all my totals, yeah, we, we have 10 rubies, we have a pink diamond, but there is two, and you'll see later. We have one of two gold diamonds, and I don't know how many silver diamonds there are, but if there's only five, that would make me happy. A nice five. We got all of Mario's items, we got the fortune teller, obviously. We have all of the pearls, and I've gotten a gold portrait on every single ghost thus far. I have more gold and bills than I even, and gold bars than I even knew was in the game. And yeah, we've gotten all of these, all of these portraits. Now, I remember I was in the habit of reading these portraits, so let's read all the ones we've gotten recently. Did we read the Uncle Grimly one? Uh, oh yes, we did. We did. We read that a while ago in the last episode. Right. So then new ones. Uh, we have Jarvis. Jarvis the Jar Collector. I don't think I said his name, but yeah, this, this was Jarvis. He loves his antique jar so much that he now lives in one. He can hardly contain himself. <laughs> <clears throat> Anyways, next up we have Sue P, the dozing girl, seven years old. What was meant to be a short nap seems to have turned into eternal rest for sweet Sue P. Yeah, so, um, in the least morbid way possible, they basically say, yeah, she died in her sleep. Which is... odd, I guess, you know, she just died from some mysterious illness. I didn't know sleep could kill, but... <laughs> I'm gonna go doze off right now, you know what I'm saying? Ah! Anyways, did it... Clockwork Soldiers have anything? They once belonged to a tightly wound toy collector, but now they march on their own without any winding. I don't think I've read that. I feel like I've never read that. <laughs> Which is weird. Um, but yeah, I think that's that's all of them. As you can see, though, we only have two portrait ghosts left, so we really are coming down to the, uh, to the wire here. And I'm debating whether or not to just have this be the final. Is, you know, stretch it out to be however long it needs to be for the game to be over. Or if we should just have it be two regular sized episodes, but I've always been a fan of like when the last episode of a series is extra long just to finish out like the last hour or so of content. So I think that's what we'll do here. In the uh, in the honor of every Let's Play that's ever ended in that particular way. I went the wrong way. <laughs> I was just needed to go down to the basement, instead I went all the way up to the third floor. Very, uh, kosher. Well, I, I, what's a good word? Very poggers of me. I don't even know what kosher means. I'm not a fashion guy. Now we're going down here to the basement. It's gonna be a grand old time. And yeah, this is the last episode of Luigi's Mansion. So I should have been, I should have said, welcome back to the finale of Luigi's Mansion. And so, like, I'll edit myself in. I'm gonna edit myself in right now saying that. Hey everyone, it's Rara, and welcome back to the finale of Luigi's Mansion. Alright, welcome back everybody, now that I edited that to be the real truth of the, the situation. Oh, and we're gonna hold out on the booze once again. Oh, more, more money? Oh, okay. I'll take that. Yeah, we're gonna... Oh god. Oh god, we're gonna walk down this hallway to this door. Into... I said into the pipe room and- Oh god, grabby ghosts! No! Oh, red 
right, grabby ghosts? No! Ah! Ah! No! No, fuck you! Fuck off! Oh god, this room sucks! Oh god, this room sucks! No! Yeah. Uh, it wouldn't be so bad if the little green ghosts weren't there, not gonna lie. If those teeny little green ghosts didn't just knock into you at every possible moment, uh, it wouldn't be so bad. But anyways, what you need to do here is freeze this lake of sewage, I guess. Yep. Walk across, and... Tap A on the pipe. The little turny thing, the, the wheel. I've always really enjoyed this moment in the mansion. This is such a strangely constructed room. There's like several layers of flooring with like a wooden tile that leads up to the higher part. Uh, just some sewage flowing through and like a pipe that stops a waterfall, sprinklers that just are dripping from the ceiling. And to this back part where there's a chest guarded by a rail. Like it's such a... Like this is this is not a room. This is this is a nightmare. Like this is what your dreams look like in terms of like actual construction. <laughs> oh, and this room leads to the room directly uh, beneath it, directly across. Yeah, I've always just appreciated that cutscene of just like, oh my god, the water shut off in this sp one corner of the room! Oh, whoa, now you can get the chest! Like, it's such a non-thing. But they make it to be this big deal, like this this huge dramatic moment with the music, and I, I just kind of love it. <laughs> I just kind of love it. Alright, but what I'm gonna do real quick is suck up this and go save. Because next up we have a portrait ghost, and you know how I'm doing those. 100% baby. Honestly, I'm thinking the real reason uh, <laughs> that I'm making this the final episode is that it just saves me the hassle of having like all those extra files of more episodes and like editing stuff, you know. <laughs> the real reason this is the final episode is because I am lazy. <laughs> Come on, give me the fire. Thank you. Oh, goodness. Oh, this room fucking sucks. Welcome to the cold storage room. Featuring everyone's favorite, Wesker the Ghost. Hot. Oh, very hot. You, you're making it too hot. I'm going to cook in this heat. I'm going to melt. Did you light these fires? What were you thinking? If we would start fires in this mansion, I'd better be ready to pay the price. Now learn your lesson! No. I, uh, no, you're not based. I am based. For I am hot. And oh god! Oh, what's happening? No, oh my gold! Oh, I hope this run fails because I lost a bunch of coins. If I 100% it now, I'm gonna cry. Okay, well... <laughs> yeah, this room sucks for multiple reasons. One, there is an ice floor, so everything is slippery and like, fuck your, fuck your controls, okay? Two, icicles infinitely spawn from the ceiling and just keep falling on you over and over again. Um, and they do, as you see, what was that, like 30, a uh, fuckload of damage, a lot of damage. So, yeah, that's not fun. And, uh, uh, three, Wesker's AI is very late game ghost. Like, he is not easy to capture by any means. In combination with the first two things especially, if you 100% him first try, that is definitely something to be happy about. You know, if you get that big pearl your first try against Wesker, the, uh... I don't even know what his moniker would be, what his title is. Is he like a mountain climber? Just some guy who's fascinated with ice? I don't know. I guess we'll find out when we read his bio, won't we? Uh, there we go. Come on now. Yeah, this is very hot. I'm gonna pay the price and uh, cook your pussy. Okay. Ugh, now the suffering begins. Ah, uh, 30? Damn, boy. He is tough. 
Yeah, the thing is that uh, I don't believe Wesker is actually required to uh, beat the game. I, I don't believe. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Let me see. Er, well, I, I guess he is. Okay, yeah, okay. Wesker is required to beat the game. Um, and they just made one... This... Uh, he's not the only required ghost that's hard. But they just made him so hard towards the end. And then, he's not the final portrait ghost, I'll let you know. I mean, obviously there was two slots. The last portrait ghost is like a breeze by comparison, and you'll see. You'll see. Forty-one! Forty-one! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why did they make this like this? One strategy that I like to use against Wesker is to wait for the icicle closest to where you're gonna like start sucking him to fall, avoid it, and then start going at him. So that at least the icicle has to respawn, and if you're gonna stay in that area for a couple seconds, you know, at least you get like somewhat have... The freedom to not get hit by the icicle. I don't know, man. Just pray. Honestly, that's the only real strategy is to pray. And I would say start it on like this, or uh, over here on this side. Kind of like facing directly at him if you can. So you can easily fire him before he shoots off any of his shit. Yeah. Oh my god, this sucks so much ass. <laughs> 49 health. This sucks so much ass. Now, you know, this isn't so hard on the 3DS version of the game where you can just do like boss battle mode where you only fight them in portraits and I am going the wrong way. Um, yeah, but the 3DS version of this game has some attributes about it that are very different, especially the, the um, what's it called? Especially the... Uh, the room that you go to to see all the ghosts. The, 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 not the study. The gallery, yeah. The gallery is very, very different in the 3DS version. And it has achievements, and it's like a whole ass thing. Um, and I really like the 3DS version quite a bit. And it has platinum versions of, um, the ghosts that you can obtain. So you better believe I have grinded my ass off for all of these ghosts way too many times. And the Platinum versions are... something else, man. Although I will say, on the 3DS, it's maybe easier because it has a very different method for capturing ghosts on the 3DS. Oh god, 42? Why, bro? Like, I... I... I was on it there. I was sucking that HP like a HP sucking hoe, man. I don't know, like a bat straight out of bat 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 straight out of ghost hell. Uh, I mean, okay, well it's hell. I guess all ghosts would go. No, because because then there's heaven, and a ghost isn't inherently evil. Although in this game, I guess they are. Like this game said, ghosts bad. Concept like if you're dead, you're just a bad person. That is just how it is. Luigi said fuck dead people. He said if you're dead, nah fam, that ain't it. That ain't it. Which I guess is inherently a little base because I don't want people to die. And who wants people to die? So like is Luigi based? Maybe. Sixty, sixty-seven. What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? He he pushes so hard. He pulls so hard. Like immediately, he's like, "Hey, Luigi, you want to take a trip around the entire room?" And I'm like, "No, no, I'm good, thanks." But Wesker, Wesker is not having it. So what I mean by that is like on the 3DS, the, the, the main meta strategy on the 3DS for sucking up ghosts is just hold 
the the you know, the, you know like the C stick or whatever the stick on the 3ds in just the just the opposite direction of the ghost. If you just hold the C stick in the opposite direction, you will almost never let go of the ghost, and you will suck them like the whole time. Like it's it's not that difficult. Like getting gold is pretty easy on the 3ds version. Platinum is difficult, but it's platinum and has different restrictions. Um, but in this version of the game, as I definitely have already explained before during this Let's Play, you know, you have to, you have to flick it back and forth. So, I guess it's not that different, but it, it very much plays very different, obviously because it's a different controller entirely. Sixty-five? What the hell? Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I think it might be in the way that I'm moving, but I, I try to move him somewhere. Um, I'm just gonna try to get him in like a corner and keep him there. I kind of forgot like the movement mechanics of Luigi's Mansion and how that works with like sucking portrait ghosts, but... <sighs> I'm gonna employ some strats here. Gotta try to keep him locked down in a corner. And we'll see how that goes. And yes, doing that every time is faster than sucking the dust, trust me. Hi, Wesker. We've done this fucking song and dance too many times. I just- No! What the hell? Alright, that's not a great start. But, uh, here we go. I'll, I'll get you. I'll get you. Uh, come on, get him. Come, come with me, buddy. You're coming with me. No, 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 this way. No, oh my god, he just doesn't want to go anywhere. Holy shit. I think I know why my strat uh, didn't work on him, and it's because you just can't control the direction he goes. His, his pull is too strong. <laughs> like, subconsciously, without thinking about using, like, the strat of just, like, pu pulling them into a corner, I was trying to. But even when consciously trying to do it, you just can't. He just pulls every which way so hard. So I'm not sure what to do anymore. <laughs> you know, I just have like impeccable flicking and pray. Oh, I didn't get the other one. Motherfucker. I don't like starting on this side. Come on. No. <laughs> oh, I am tired. <laughs> I said, oh, this is gonna be challenging, but doable. I'm gonna do an all gold portraits let's play. <laughs> I said, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, like I haven't done a, I haven't done a let's play Luigi's Mansion or, or like a full playthrough in a while. It's gonna be a, a breath of fresh air. Get them all gold. It's, it's gonna be a tough challenge, but not that tough. But Wesker changes things a little bit. I'd rather go back and do the Clockwork Soldiers, honestly. I would rather have to perfect that one again. Are you fucking kidding? Come on! My... my thumb is in pain from, uh, flicking, and... <sighs> I don't... <sighs> uh, I am suffering for this art. If you could call the process of making a video art, I would. But, I, I'm, I'm definitely suffering for, for my art. <sighs> and if you like the video, then just absolutely smash Smash Wesker's fucking bussy for me, please. Because that'll let me know that you like the video. Don't ask how. Just know that I suffered, and, um... 
You're watching it. No, 35, motherfucker. No, just please. Just let me get the good RNG. I just. To all those out there who haven't done this, you know, just go hug your mother, you know. Make sure that she knows you love her before you commit on a live because you've been trying to gold Wesker in the Weedies Mansion for <laughs> too fucking long. Uh. Oh, what? I didn't know I got the other one. Okay, well, I guess we're starting the fight from all the way over here. Uh. Oh, fuck, no. Okay. Oh, 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 oh! No! It's all right. It'll happen again. I'm getting I'm getting closer and closer each time, um, and I, I can feel it. It is it is gonna happen, some, some sometime soon. Everything is okay. Every, every everything is gonna it's gonna be okay. You know, if you ever feel like you're at a point in your life where Things are just too much, uh, and that you just don't know the direction your life is heading in anymore. Um, yeah, it's, it's gonna be okay. Really. You know, things do get better with time. And just look at me, for instance, you know, like, one day, one moment in time in the unknown future, I won't be fighting Wesker in the Luigi's Mansion anymore. Ugh. God, if... I'm gonna brag about this, like... <laughs> I'm gonna be like, yeah, we'll have you gold-portraited Wesker in the GameCube version of Luigi's Mansion? No? I don't want to hear it then. I, I don't- I don't give a shit about your opinion. <laughs> unless you've- unless you've fucking... Golden Wesker at GameCube Luigi's Mansion. Then I don't want to fucking hear your lip, okay? <laughs> no, no, come here. That wasn't even close to a good attempt. <laughs> what, he had like 66? Oh my god. I'm just going through the motions at this point. Like, I, I barely even been paying attention to what's happening. I just know that I fail Wesker, I reload, I walk over here without even thinking. Like, I was looking at my phone just now, and I just... I'm very tired. Fifty-seven. Who to thunk? Not me. Okay, so my right hand is going a little numb. <sighs> to be fair, I do need to drink some water. I ran out in between this recording and the last. Um, and I'm not even sure if I want this to be- No! No, I didn't want to start the booze! No, no, please, stop. Oh, please, stop. Okay, if I can get it back in here, then I guess I'll just get this one boo. I did not mean to get this guy. I- Please. Okay, go back into your room. We'll catch you, then we'll save. So at least I can say I've made some fucking progress this episode. 
Oh, we got a single boo. Wow. Oh, I should have saved right there. What? Why did I? Why did I not save? I don't know. I just, you know, if if Toad isn't involved and if I can't get it on with my little mushroom friend, then I'm not even sure if I want to save. But yeah, I do remember my sentiments about the end of episode eight when I, or you know, at some point in episode eight when I was saying like, yeah, I just want Luigi's Mansion like to be over with because I. You know, had my fill of the game, and, and it's true. It's true. I came back to it so fresh-faced, like, oh my god, I, I, oh, it's so fun. And, like, this game is fun, but not when you're going for all gold portraits. Not when you're going for Wesker's gold portrait. This sucks, man. This is not okay. Like, I think I found a new form of torture. Just sit down my enemies and be like, yeah. You can't leave until you beat Gold... Gold Wesker. They're just, like... It's like months later and they're like, please. Please, I will sell out my family, just let me go. And I'm like, no, you're not allowed, you have to beat Wesker Gold. And they're like, I can't. I will literally sit here until I die. Until, until the end of time. But I will not be able to do this. And I'm like, you know what, fam? That's fair, you can go. Because legit, like, I've put you through too much already. <laughs> you know, I think my brother was watching this playthrough. No, I, I know he was, because he would comment about how shit I am at the game. Because, <laughs> you know, looking out outward in, He's allowed to say this kind of bullshit. <laughs> oh, and he he had thoughts about the Pikmin Let's Play, for sure. He let me know just how dog shit I was at Pikmin. And to be fair, it had been a lot of years since I played the game. It wasn't the greatest playthrough, but I still did. I, had I got all 30 parts, okay? I did my best. I completed the game, so um, I'm proud of that. And you know what, Toby? Oh god, if you are watching this, um, then go beat Wester Gold. Do it. Do it. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. If this is the- if this is the run, then it was worth losing like 30 coins. If that is the sacrifice, if that is the tribute that must be paid, then I will give up 30 coins. Oh my god, no way? Oh my god, no way. I thought that it actually was the price that needed to be paid. He was like, ah yes, 30 coins. Finally, now I will rest peacefully. Or was it 30 coins? Maybe it was less than, I don't actually, you know. <sighs> you guys, you all got the bit. It doesn't matter the exact count of coins. I think if you're in a frustration it's just not good for the body. Like, I feel it in my temples. Like, I am... I'm physically getting tired of this. <laughs> you know, like, you can, like, feel it in your face. I feel it in the, the pit of my stomach. Uh, that might just be that I'm hungry, but... You know, like, I feel feelings about things. Emotions. Strong emotions. Like, fuck this. <laughs> that is the strongest emotion that I'm feeling right now. Fuck this. How to beat Wesker in Luigi's Mansion. Luigi's Mansion, Wesker Gold Portraits. Wait a minute, is it not Wesker? Oh my god, this is- it's Sir Weston. I know a lot about this game, but I- I forgot that it's actually Sir Weston and not Sir Wesker. Interesting. 
Oh boy, the comments. Oh god, the comments. Just I hear it now. People screaming like it's fucking Weston, you brainlit. <sighs> I'm sorry. I just I. I'm sorry. Oh what? Now that is a strat. Holy shit! Wait, really? All right, well, I uh, just learned something that I'm gonna try to put into gameplay. It probably won't work, cause I'm me. All right, so the strat is to kind of get him caught on the campfire on the left. Like, you know, light this campfire, okay. And go this way. And when you start sucking him, make sure it's like over here and then like get him caught on this campfire. Yeah. Oh, fuck. I, oh, no, I fucked it up, though. No, he, he escaped. Oh, I needed to start it, like, there. No! 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 Ah! It, this, <laughs> 19. I'm only barely consciously doing this. I... I don't even know anymore. I think it's just become a rhythm. Alright. Back to focusing. So we get the one on the right. Then we light the one on the left. Okay. Now we have some time after we unthaw him to actually like go and suck him. So we don't have to worry really. We just... Okay. Let me walk over here. Oh no! Ah! How do they do it? Oh god! No! Fuck! Honestly, the past two have been kind of decent, but like I don't know how they got them caught there on the on the fire. Honestly, just knowing that there is a strat out there, kind of. <laughs> reignited my passion a little bit. It's it's got got me riled up and thinking like maybe I can do this before I grow old. Oh fuck. Ow. Okay. Come on, give me the fire. G give. Thank you. Okay. I just gotta get the shot to work though. Is the difficult thing. I I don't know how exactly he did it. But he just walked into the corner and Wesker didn't pull him out of it. Oh fuck. No. No. Oh, like this! Oh, I kinda had it for a second there, fuck! I kind of had it for a second there, but then he pulled me so hard to make up for it. Like, if I combined the first 20 with, like, the last 80 of a good attempt, you know, like, so somehow I got him to, like, 19 before, like, pretty low. I was thinking, like, maybe that could combine to give me the full, like, 90. Oh, yeah, and I just realized I don't even need the 100. I just need 90. I just need that 90, bro. Okay, yep. All the bad boys gonna learn the lesson when they come for you, yada yada yada, gimme. Give, give no. No, no, go back in your corner. No, go back. No! Fuck! When I start in the corner, I'm like, yes, I got it, and then he pulls me right out of it. But, like, in the video, the guy just stayed there the whole time, basically, till like, the very end, like, the last 20 health. And I just need a run like that. Hell, if I get a run that goes under, like, 50 at the campfire, and then he moves out, I probably got it. You know, like, I haven't done that terrible in the past few... Oh! 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 
Oh, 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 yes, yes, oh, oh, give me, give me, give me, give me all the pearls, give me all the fucking pearls, no, the pearls, the pearls, no, come on, yes, oh my god, 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 oh, 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 oh. oh. Mo. <laughs> we did it. We did it. <laughs> Fuck you, Sir Weston the Chili Climber. He's a 30 year old climber. This strange fellow's icy abode may be the reason he hasn't warmed up to being a ghost. Ah. <sighs> Oh my god, I don't... I... I'm not okay. This is this is not okay. <sighs> I feel like this has to be its own episode. I feel like this just has to be like the Sir Weston episode. So... Now that the lights are on, the spikes stop falling. And it's just slippery in here. So we can open up this key. And you can pick up the key normally, but it's funnier if you like slide into it like this. And then like Luigi slides off the camera. <laughs> oh. That that doesn't give me that much joy. After having like I don't feel happy having beaten West Weston. I just I feel relief that I don't have to do that anymore. Um, so in the next episode of Luigi's Mansion, I'm, I'm gonna get the last booze, we're gonna do the last portrait ghost, and then we're gonna finish this, this fucking dog shit video game. Alright. Yeah. Also, why are there only 19 portrait ghosts? One... Three, six, twelve, eight. Wait, I mean six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-two. But you take out Chauncey, you take out Bogmire, twenty. Uh, you take out Bulasis, nineteen. Uh, six, twelve, eighteen. That's fifteen, eighteen, nineteen. Yeah. So like the totals are seventy-six small and medium pearls and nineteen big pearls. It seems weird. Weird. Like, why didn't they just do 80, 80, 20? Like, why didn't they just make one more portrait ghost? I don't know. It is what it is. But yeah, I have been Red Fox Rara, and I will catch you all in the next episode of Luigi's Mansion. The finale, ladies and gents. So, um, let that be a thing. It, oh wait, I, I just realized I can't end the episode yet because I'm not in front of Toad. Hold on. Alright, now we can end the episode proper now that we're here with Toad and we can save. And I just want to say, um... If you want Toad to fucking, I don't know, step on you and spit on you and call you a dirty fucking whore, then, um, I don't know, smash the like button or something. I'll see you in the next one, everybody. The, the the last last episode. <sighs>